So today I'm tuning a uh, half bridge FD with a gear 35R on an uh, Adaptronic 440. It's, a, it's an older ECU, it still works perfectly, but we just gotta clean up the map because we change injectors. So we're gonna go through, I'll show you a little bit of how to mess with this thing. So let's see, let me hook it up. Now you have to just turn the car on. Let it do like a log log map to see where it's at and then go from there just to adjust at the boost that right now not to raise the boost or anything else like that. We hit the first pool and then they should start fucking puking everywhere. So what are you doing, Mike? What'd you ah. find? What did you find? Uh, what? It's full of uh, it's overfilled with oil and the oil shit. So you never change the oil before bringing it to the dyno, right? Yeah. So now we have to change the oil on the car, clean up the little mess it made, because since the oil is really thin because it's old, it basically is water and it just fucking blows out of the whole engine when it goes into boost yeah. and change the spark plugs too because i'm pretty sure if he didn't change the oil he probably didn't change the spark plugs good thing I, we caught it early basically it was our first pool and halfway through the pool we noticed it leaking a little bit of oil at the oil filler neck so we stopped right away so do that and then get back to tuning so guys the boy billy changing the spark plugs they're so oily well they're oily but more more in depth, the uh, guy changed injectors without putting the correct settings. So these, you can tell they're brand new, but you can actually mess them up since the car's running way too rich. It can follow the plugs, them being new as they look. They're still bad. So Billy's putting some new ones before we get back to the dyno because that's just hot and I don't want to do it. And Billy's the man. Thanks, Billy.
the FD's tune, it's about like 390, almost 400 to the wheels at 13 pounds, is that right now? It's just like, it's pretty reasonable for just being pump gas and low timing, cause it's an FD, but the guy drifts it. And with drift cars, you don't go wild on timing or horsepower, cause then you run into liability issues. So horsepower is perfect. 400 to the wheels when it's cold, basically it's perfect. Plenty of power, have fun. Uh, conservative, so timing is really low. So at 14 degrees of timing on 93 octane. So that's like, the car can get beaten on, not blow up. So after I just did like, I did all the power pulls and I like, got uh, mid range, transient throttle, all that shit, but roughly. So after you do the rough pulls, then you turn the car off, sit down, uh, and you see where the, the map was going through and you adjust the numbers so you make everything linear so it's like a really smooth map which is what Mike's doing right now so you can tell the map's like it has like all those little dips and everything so what he's doing is like so if we're right here we're at let me zoom in so if it's 57 over here it's like 90 and 70 what you do is you try to smoothen it all out to ramp it up smoothly and then towards the end like uh, over here the most the most we saw uh, wow, I just like going into, I like, just like cruising, basically cruising was uh, 80 milliseconds. But you see after after 5,000, it's like 112, 114. So all that shit, I didn't have to rev the engine that high to uh, to know that it's off. So, so it's 86 at 47 RPMs. So we just start lowering all the way to the red line. Same thing as in going into boost, like wide open to boost. We're at 102, but over here it's like 110, 115. So all that shit needs to go down. So basically just ramp it up smoothly. And after that, you turn the car on, do another pull, and cr make sure it's perfect, and then, and then you're done. So I mean, it's pretty simple. All right, so flex fuel tuning 101 with Mike. So when we turn the key. As you can see in the bottom, so the fuel's in there already, it's already reading, and now we're just setting up the, um, so the enrichment. Now we're just gonna try to figure out around where we're at. This one has got um, additional like enrichments for cranking, 
so you set up base enrichment and then uh the low and high map you can add or take fuel away uh and it will actually depending on the content like take away a percentage so mainly we just gotta now we just gotta do the high map so hook up the intercooler pipe again start doing boost pulls and start racing that number until we get the afr sweep oh so you're tuning all motor i was tuning all motor right now mm -hmm. so the 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 low map is already done mm -hmm. which is no boost now we're gonna move on to the high map so we had she had to take away 10 percent on the low map can't see so, shit can't see shit yeah so Thank you.